Now, retired members of the Nigerian Armed Forces in Lagos have expressed their dissatisfaction about the term as unkind treatment by the government. They made their intentions known during a peaceful protest, threatening that the Armed Forces Remembrance Day will not hold if their entitlements are not paid. Destiny Momo has more. Bearing placards with different inscriptions, the veterans marched to the Lagos State House of Assembly. Pleading to the government, they wondered why they have been left to suffer untold hardship after years of dedicated service. An old man that is retiring from service, he must have high blood pressure, he must have diabetes. None of these are captured in the medical package that you say you are offering. They said their expectations have been dashed over and would not want the same to continue. The national media director, Omer Nukidivi, reeled out their demand. This set of people are very disciplined and they are dying in hunger. They are dying in sicknesses and disease, frustration, high blood pressure. The medical they gave, it can't even treat uh, diabetes. It can't even treat um, kidney failure. Even these glasses I did, I paid for the lens. I had you all the, sorry, the frame. You go and buy your frame yourself or you pay. So what are the ailments that you are supposed to capture in the medical for an elderly veteran? You know, so the, the irresponsibility and the, the insensitivity is alarming. So the whole states in the Federation are going to have this rally today, within this week that we see, running towards the Armed Forces Remembrance Day. And if we are not getting the alerts for all the things we are asking for, which they know, then we'll go and see them in the Armed Forces Remembrance Day. The protesters claimed that their national health insurance scheme only covers malaria and typhoid fever, lamenting that their counterparts in other countries enjoy more privileges after service. The SDA, the Special Department Allowance, which my colleagues have also mentioned here, that money was approved. Now some set of um, the armed forces was paid starting 2017, which were left behind. That's our number two demand. The three demand, we have some medically bothered members. They've been enjoying some allowances. Now, all of a sudden, that allowance was cut off. So we are demanding that that allowance should be restored. Some of us don't have money to take care of our medical bills. And our medical bills only take care uh, of the NHIS that they gave us, only take care of malaria and typhoid fever, which is a little, which is nothing to write home about. So if you're having like diabetes and hypertension or kidney or whatever problem you're having, you are on your own. And we little pay in us that they pay us, cannot sustain us. Although the fallen heroes have been seemingly remembered, these veterans want full implementation of their rights as living heroes. Destiny Momo for Plus TV Africa. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.